This is another video of Cognos 10.2 training by Bharti DW Consultancy. In this video, we're going to talk about the second report, which is for country heads too. Please note that these requirement documents were shared in earlier videos in which we understood what is the requirement we are going to work on. And also in the previous set of videos, we did develop this CFO dashboard. So in this video, we are going to tackle the report number two, which is for country heads. So country heads is a different set of is a different set of users. Uh, so in this, we need to create a report with country, city, year, sales amount, and sales quantity. Also, we want to put a prompt or a couple of prompts, one on country, another on city, and we'll make, make it cascade. Then it talks about a drill through link, which we, which we are gonna tackle later. So the first thing is this, let's do it. So go back to your Cognos connection. These, this is the report which we created the last time. Go here and click on Report Studio and it opens up this click on create new I'm gonna use existing template we have this report template so this template opens up with the project uh, the, the framework manager project I mean. So from the customers, I'm gonna drag country and city. And I'm gonna drag sales amount, which is the unit cost and unit price. So unit price and sales quantity. I'm going to drag. Make sure when you are dragging, you want to wait for this blinking arrow and you drop it. I need ear. Ear is available in the calendar dimension. So you will get sale ear and drop it between city and unit price. Next, we're going to format this list. So you can see these three dots. If you select on the properties section, here you would see list. Right click, say style, and say apply table style. And there are a lot of styles available here. You pick anything you like, perfectly fine. But I like this rose one, which is good. Or also you can, you can choose contemporary or modern. Let's use modern in this case. There you go. Now let's just run it and check the report. So this is the report. So few things we are going to group by country and city. Then we want to group by the unit price and quantity. So let's do that. Sorry, not group by, but the total. So select country and city. Use control key on your keyboard and click on this group. You have group by and then select unit price and you quantity use control and go on this total click on total here so there you go 
I do not need subtotals for city so I'm gonna select it and click on delete save this report as country heads 2 next we have to create a prompt page so go to page explorer click on prompt page on the from the left drag prompt page on the right double click prompt page you can change the name here you can say country head report number two next from the toolbox select value prompt and drag and drop the value prompt on the right side it will ask you for parameters use a convention lowercase p country that will tell me it's a prompt p and country select next from the package item I am going to select country use in because let me select multiple countries for now next I want to select query so I would say query underscore p underscore country it will tell me it's a query for prompt country and say finish next drop drop a new value prompt and this time say p underscore city do the same thing select cities in only select the first query I do not want to apply this filter on this query for prompt country and say query underscore p underscore city there you go now run the report and you can see India but you can see that also on the right side even if I select India you have Chicago London New York which is which are not the cities for India all right we will fix it by using cascade prompts in our next video so for now it's working so keep following these video series and we are going to talk about drill throughs cascading prompts and a lot many other things for report number two and you can see that with this project we are building up we are building up complexities and we are going to learn a lot in the coming sessions thank you for watching